What's up guys? Make sure to check out my video that'll be coming soon. It's a video about my turtle, what we're gonna do with it during winter. But I'm gonna show you my back pasture. We finally laid this concrete stuff down. Thank God. And looks like it did look like it was gonna rain earlier. It's cleared up a lot. We kind of need the rain, but yeah. I'll show you some more of my backfield. There's Jack. I guess we'll head back here. Here he comes. Hello, Jack. We're gonna have to burn trash today. Burn something, start a fire, get these off you. We'll try the garlic thing next year. Oh, God. Chickens in the creek. Yep. That creek's dry. That creek's dry. I'd say we're not going to get it filled up again this year because it's been it hasn't been raining. But we're going to go ahead back there and I'm going to show you. We got some old cages and stuff that might be put to use next summer. We don't know yet. And this will be getting bush hogs soon. Oh yeah, and by the way, if I do get my emus, which that would definitely be next summer. Because I'm getting a job and paying for them myself. Well, oh I thought that was a snake. That was a bottle of some sort. I'll pick that up when we come back through. But anyways, you can't get them a bob wire fence or just like a short fence. Nope. They will either jump over that or try to run through bob wire. So you got to get them a tall steel fence. That's what's recommended. A really tall fence. Probably about, most people get them 12 foot fence. I'll probably get them 12 foot fence. Just a go. I mean, just a quick tip. Make sure you're wearing pants while walking through this. Okay, I get it. My neighbor's always revving up that motorcycle and that thing's about torn up. I know you heard them. Shut up. Oh, that's that stupid Mustang, actually. Speeds down the road. He shouldn't be doing it because there's kids on the road but you know he doesn't give a crap all right here's a, here's a little clearing here because this kind of just stays like this big old oak tree look how huge that is that's massive trust me it looks bigger in person that's the old part to a tractor I don't bet it this is broken that's why it's just sitting back here I don't even know what that thing is. Ew, cow poop. This is a nice fence I could use to raise baby emus, but of course I'm going to go over top of it with a better wiring because something could get in that easily. These are very heavy fences, by the way. They would need pulled by a tractor. We used to raise chicks in here. Of course, it's rusted a little bit. See, there's roosting things. Food bowls are still in there and a big heat lamp still in there. I wonder if it still works. It's kind of broke, so we'd repair it. Put better wiring on it. Soon I'll have a camera. The zoom will be better. Okay, so... A tree fell on that part of fence. We'll get that repaired probably next summer because we won't have time now. We tried to get it, but we haven't had time, much time. There's more important work to do. Nothing could get out of it. So for now, it's fine. A big ice storm made all these trees and stuff fall. That's an old um, bush hog. There's another one, and that's a newer bush hog just sitting back here. We still use this one sometimes. Some old wagons. An old horse trailer. 
All right, so I'm going to go back and go back to the creek that stays the other creek, and I'll show you the guys that, so I'll be right back. Wild berries, that's very neat. I didn't even know I was still filming. So here's the fence I'm on. Alright, so I just crossed the fence. There's the trailers. A lot of old buckets. Alright, so we just got there here. Whole open land. We have cows roaming this, but... Like I said, my emus would probably have a square like going all the way across to them trees. All the way to probably that tree is my plan. We're not for certain yet. Ouch, I just got cut by a bushel. Those don't feel too good to get cut on. All right. Okay, so I walked a little ways. We have a lot of land to work with as you can see. When I move to Kentucky, I am trying to get a lot more land. Walk through this clearing here. Okay, watch out for the bushel. Did you guys hear that? That was a hawk. Oh, God. Every time I cross that, I hit the thorn bush. My son is... Right, baby. All right, here's our second creek. This stays filled. Massive bullfrog. Just listen at him. Did you hear that? That's a massive bullfrog. It's a little low. It's usually up really high, but you know, the fact that we've been getting no rain, that's just why it's kind of low right now it's kind of dirty we're probably going to clean it out soon but really it's just a natural creek so do not like those bushes that's where we found snakes so keep your distance from bushes and brushels like that okay that's the neighbor's yard don't need to show you guys that and here's another little pond, slap full of minnows. Oh my God. I promise you that's not rain, that's minnows. I can't wait to get, oh, big frog. I can't wait to get my bait well again. Call me if you think I should make a fish trap when I get my bait well, see what I can catch. There's a little bit of lily pad growing. I might get some of that for my bait well. I'll get some of that cow tongue right there. But look at all those movements. Slap full of minnows. And we, no, we did not put them in there. If I had a GoPro, I wouldn't care to stick it down in there. But I wouldn't just reach my arm in there. I'd connect the GoPro to something because there's water moccasin in here sometimes. I don't know if you can see any minnows, but all those movements are freaking minnows. Okay, I'm going to show you the last parts. Well, there's more, but I don't have storage to show you all. Oh, my God. Used to jump dirt bikes through here. Pretty awesome. I am not seeing the horses or the cows. I'm assuming they're in the other pasture. Still hear them full bullfrogs going on. Oh my god. You're not cool, buddy. And if you look over here, I, yes, I know I gotta walk mostly around. I could just cross through that fence. Wish they would flipping stop it. 
That's the other side of the barn. That's where my duck coop is. Focus. Focus. Thank you. I'm going to end this right now. Hope you enjoyed. That's just showing a little bit of my pasture. I'll see you in the turtle video. Peace.